Hello everyone, welcome to Python learning series for network engineers. This is the second video on PyATS. Here we will see how to run example script to validate PyATS installation. In the first video we have seen how to install PyATS into Python virtual environment. We have installed this into Python 3.10 and I am using Ubuntu operating system. And to validate the installation we can use example script. So to test the example script, first we need to clone this particular repository. So I'll copy this and I will clone this to PyATS base folder. And to test this, first we need to run basic example job.py file. So we'll go to the directory examples basic and basic example job.py file and here they are importing py ats run and running this particular script basic example script.py and using run they are executing this particular script and if you look into this script we have multiple classes available one is common setup and we have two test case classes tc1 and tc2 so that is under test case section and we have a common cleanup section where we have one common cleanup class and inside that we have multiple methods so this is called decorators we can pass functions as an argument to another function we don't have to get into those details at this stage we can just look into this so we have multiple methods here inside common setup we have two methods one is sample section 1 and another is sample section 2 and same way inside tc1 we have four one is prepared test case and here it is just logging some message and simple test one also we are just logging some message saying that first test section and simple test two second test section then inside test case two you can see here simple test one and simple test two here simple test one is failing so here it is giving self dot failed so this will be showing us failed and after that we have a common cleanup section in real time in common setup we will be setting up the devices validating the physical connectivity then initiating the traffic so for common setup we will be setting up the entire environment and in test case section we'll be executing actual test cases and in cleanup section we'll be reverting all the configurations and making the state back to the common setup section and we'll try running this so let me copy this particular command we are executing pi ats cla command I'll run this and we'll compare this with the test file so here inside test case 2 the simple test 1 is failed and here we should be able to see the message also the failed reason is this is an internal failure it is coming from this message just to understand the structure of this pi ats they have given this so this is how in real time we will be executing the test cases so we will have a common setup then a test case section and common cleanup and if you see the messages here so 
so the test script file is the example script the same file name and after that it is starting the common setup it is starting the common setup then here you can see the log dot info the same log message you should be able to see here a test common setup and that that is from subsection one in real time we'll be adding some of the validation use cases here then in the second method we are even giving the section name so inside and section name you can see here inside subsection sample section 2 then inside class common setup so here also you can see it is passing the class and both are passed then it is starting the test case and inside test case 1 uh, you can see here so it is starting the prepare test case and inside prepare test case it is printing a log preparing the test so same thing we are getting here after that in the simple test one it says first test section and for the simple test two also the second test section after that in tc2 it is failing now to remove that error i will comment this and before running that we can even verify the log view i'll copy this run this from terminal so it automatically opened the browser session and here we should be able to see the status so tc2 is failed now but tc1 is success you can see here prepare test case simple test 1 simple test 2 and common cleanup also is success now i will comment this failure scenario save it and we'll try running this again i have to run the py ads run job command now we'll run the log view so now we can see everything is passed because we have commented this particular failed scenario so this will help you to understand the structure of pi ats execution and in the next video we will see how to add a cisco device and run pi ats cli command to validate the configuration and parse the configuration and how to create a test bed file i hope this video was helpful for you to understand the example script file thanks for watching see you in the next video